Good, my name is Brother Thomas. Good to see you again, once again, for Sunday School. All right, this week's lesson is about sharing. Jesus teaches us about sharing. And our memory verse is from Lou. Our, 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 our topic is taken from the book of St. Luke. And our memory verse, we be learning our memory verse all month long. And it's from the book of St. John the 14th chapter, verse 23. And Jesus answered and said, Obey my word. Our obey is teachings. And all of God's words, or all of his teachings, is from the Bible. Welcome, welcome, welcome. As we say, we're talking about sharing. And what are some of the things that we share? Why we like to share? Do you like to share your toys? Do you like to share your food? Do you like to share your clothes? Well, it's always good to share because there is someone less fortunate than you that, and you when when you have too much, it's like hoarding. You know, hoarding is like when I have ten of the same Batman sh shirt. Why don't I share with others? When I have 10 of the same toys, you know, it's good, always good to share. When you share, it shows that you want care. When you share, it shows that you want care. Yes, and remember, everything that we learn here at Sunday School, where it comes from, it's come from the Bible, the B. I B L E and what is the Bible? What is the Bible class? You know it. The Bible is the Word of God. And what we do with the Word of God? We read it daily. We read it daily. And when we read the Bible, what it becomes a part of us. And we love it. And when we love it, what to do? We share the word of God. We tell others. We tell others about the goodness of Jesus. And and as we said, today's lesson is about sharing. And do you like more? A lot of people like more. It's okay to have, but remember what is more important? What is more important? Your life or having more? We're gonna learn about a farmer that have too much and what Jesus tell him that it is more important Rather to have more or listen, listen and follow. Give it in love, store it above, give it with a willing heart. Give it in love, store it above, give it with a willing heart. And we're talking today about Jesus teaches us how to share. Dear God, thank you for sending, for sharing your son, Jesus Christ with us in Jesus name. Amen. Amen. There was a story in the Bible. There was a rich man that have so much that one ear is his farm gave him so much grains. He got a lot of grains. And what he do he store them and and what he said, right? I will tear down my old barns 
and get a bigger balance and save this all for myself. What he's gonna do, he's gonna tear down the old barn because he don't have enough room to save all the grains. But Jesus knew that the man was a little bit selfish and Jesus told him, why are you gonna do that? You might not have enough time to eat and to save all that grains and no one will inherit it. Jesus know that he will not have enough time. He will probably pass away and no one share. So what Jesus was telling, so it's better to share than to save up everything for yourself and make your riches be in heaven. What Jesus told him, make sure that your riches is in heaven. What Jesus is telling him, you must always put your heart on the things of the Lord. Yes, children, we must always put our heart and the things of the Lord. Because remember, one day we shall be no more and no one will, will inherit. So we must always share what we have. If we, Just remember, if you're a farmer and you pluck, 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 and you got a good ear and you inherit all these stuff, remember to share it with others because there are others that's less fortunate than you. So give it in love, store it above, give it with a willing heart. And Jesus, this is what Jesus told us to do, to share. And remember our memory verse, Jesus answered and said, obey my word or obey my teaching. God bless you. I hope you get something from this level. Dear Jesus, thank you for this day as we share with each other. In Jesus' name, amen. Give it in love.